Today, I'm being Ronaldo back in the Champions League, but every time we complete a challenge with him, he's going to get one foot shorter, with the aim of making Ronaldo the shortest Champions League winner ever. To do this, we have to put Ronaldo back at United and back in the Champions League. But there's a twist. We only have five attempts to complete each challenge, and every time we fail, Ronaldo gets one foot taller and one step further away from achieving his goal. There is no chance Cristiano Ronaldo will do this. I am the shortest Champions League winner ever, and it will start that way. And that didn't sit right with me, so we're going to prove Messi wrong. And Ajax is the first game of the tournament. As you can see, we have 10 boxes and behind each box is a challenge we're going to have to complete with Ronaldo. I'm just going to go for a random box number four, volley outside of the box. That's the first challenge. Let's do it. There was one thing I forgot to mention. Uh, Ronaldo's a giant. Yep, he is nine foot. <laughs> Look at him. Oh my God. Let's get that volley. Let's get that volley. We've got five attempts. Oh! oh my God. Five attempts. That was attempt number one. Ronaldo, attempt number two. Oh, that was so close. Ronaldo, this is it. Ronaldo. No, that's attempt number three. Ronaldo. Ronaldo. Oh, this is it. Set piece to Ronaldo. He volleys it. Oh, Ronaldo. Oh, my God. Bruno Fernandes. What an assist. It didn't take long for nine foot Ronaldo to score again. And then we attempted a header because why not? Ronaldo's nine foot. It's on his head. Go, on, Ronaldo. Oh, he's done it. And he wins the first game against Ajax. All right, Ronaldo is now going from eight foot five to seven foot five. And we still can't even see his face yet. Let's find out the next challenge with Ronaldo. We're going to go for box number two. And box number two is the El Tornado. Next up, we have Man United versus Lisbon. Ronaldo's first ever club. Oh, here he is. Seven foot five, Ronaldo. I can do it. Oh, attempt number one. Here it is. El Tornado. Oh, attempt number one. Giant Ronaldo is simply too good. Ronaldo then decided to showboat against his old club and score this. And then Sporting pulled one back after De Gea went for his lunch mid-game. What the hell was the goalkeeper doing? Sporting kept up the pressure and got lucky once again, making the game level. And once again, Sporting had another chance, which they buried home, taking the lead. But Giant Ronaldo took that personally and got one back to equalize. But Ronaldo wasn't done there. Oh my god, Ronaldo. <laughs> Never doubting Ronaldo, who absolutely turned the game around to put United back ahead. Sporting Lisbon was simply no match for giant Ronaldo. He's just too good. He is way too overpowered. All right, we're now reducing Ronaldo to six foot five. We can now see his face. All right, next up, we have Man United versus Dortmund, the last game of the group stage. And as you can see, Ronaldo is now a pretty normal height, but he's going to get shorter and shorter the more challenges we complete. It's now time to find out the next challenge we have to do with Ronaldo. Let's find out. Let's go for number 10, a power shot. Okay, Ronaldo, power shot number one. Oh my God, what a save. A chance fell for Dortmund's Munier who capitalized on it, making it 1-0. Ronaldo then had a huge opportunity to bring it back. Please, power shot. Boom. Oh my God, it's gone straight at the keeper. Dortmund then struck again, making it 2-0. The pressure was now on. Oh no, no, no. But then Ronaldo had this huge opportunity from a beautiful ball. Ronaldo, Ronaldo, power shot. Oh my God, we've hit the post. And to make it worse, Dortmund then scored again. And again. But then just when you thought it was over, Ronaldo did this. Yeah! <laughs> what a goal! 133 miles an hour! Ronaldo then slots a beautiful through ball to Rashford, who's 1v1 against the keeper, and scores! The comeback, baby! Let's go! Ronaldo then has another big opportunity. Can he find another goal? Ronaldo! Ronaldo! Come on, there's two minutes left. The whistle blows and Ronaldo faces his first loss of the tournament. We failed the comeback, but nevertheless, Ronaldo got his power shot in five attempts. It's now time to shrink Ronaldo to five foot five. All right, so Man United are now playing Atlanta in the round of 16. But there's a twist. Every goal we can see now, our opponents are going to get one foot taller. It's time to find out the next type of goal we're going to have to score with Ronaldo. Let's go for number three. Oh, no. We need to score free kick with Ronaldo. Free kick number one. You've got this. First attempt. Can he do it? Free kick number two. This is in a promising position. Come on, Ronaldo. Please. Ronaldo, attempt number three. Oh my God, it was so close. Ronaldo, attempt number four. I'm starting to get a bit nervous. Starting to get a bit shaky, you know? I mean, I'm a little bit weak. So we need to score this one. Boom. Mini Ronaldo, attempt number five. It's now or never. Come on, Ronnie. Please. Please. Yes, he's in. He's actually done it. Oh, my God. And straight after the free kick, Ronaldo scored this. Mini Ronaldo shoots. He scores. Mini Ronaldo. <laughs> Sweet. 
But then Atlanta scored this banger late in the game. What a goal! Atlanta then had a chance in the 92nd minute, which is a patter buried home to equalize. But Ronaldo said, hold my beer, and scores a beautiful finesse to win the game. Mini Ronaldo! He got a hat trick in the 90th minute. His back was beginning to hurt from carrying this team. Ronaldo is now going down another foot. <laughs> small he is and he's only gonna get shorter and shorter the more challenges we complete it's man united versus barcelona in the quarterfinals and uh let's just say they're going to be nine foot giants all right we're heading back onto the random mystery box to find out what goal we're gonna have to score next a penenka penalty oh my god look at ronaldo he's smaller than the kid <laughs> look how small ronaldo is bro <laughs> penalty number one i don't know how we're gonna do it but we're just going straight for the middle Okay, great. Penalty number two. Top right. Attempt number three. We're going to put some power on this one. Penalty number four. Ronaldo. Top left, please. Oh, we've done it. We actually scored a Penenka against a nine-foot giant. Mini Ronaldo. Oh, he's ran it in the net. But then the legendary AI truly showed why they're legendary with this goal. Oh, God. And like a schmuck, Maguire conceded a penalty. Oh, God. Please go right. But then Ronaldo instantly responds, shooting Man United ahead in the game. Ronaldo! He's done it again! And then Mini Ronaldo scored this. Boom! Oh! <laughs> He's too good. But just as he thought the game was done, Barcelona scored again. Ah, oh, to seal the deal. To seal the deal, Ronaldo! And that was enough for Man United to progress through to the semi-finals. All right, we completed that challenge, so Ronaldo gets a bit shorter. He is now the shortest Ronaldo possible. The semi-finals is Man United versus PSG, so it's time for Ronaldo versus Messi. We've only got a couple more challenges left. Let's find out our next challenge. We're going for number four to score Traveller shot. Oh my God, they're massive. He's literally this big. Wait, they've got KSI on their team. <laughs> Wait, what's happening? Who's that? Is that Mr. Beast? No, not Mr. Beast. Oh my god, we've conceded. And then Mr. Beast put them 2 0 up. We need the Traveller shot, Ronaldo. No, that's a chip. Ronaldo! You meant to Traveller that. As if that wasn't bad enough, Messi added a third. Traveller! Traveller! Please tell me that was the outside of the foot. It's not a Traveller. We can't count it. And on the last attempt, Ronaldo finally scored the Traveller. But time was now running out to win the game. And just as the game seemed done, in the literal last seconds, Ronaldo had this opportunity. Ronaldo! Ronaldo! Oh my god! Look at the time! Ronaldo somehow produced a piece of magic to keep United in the Champions League. We're going straight to penalties. Whoever wins right now is through to the final. Sergio Ramos, 9 foot versus De Gea. Oh, he's missed! Bruno Fernandes. He's going to be cheeky here. Oh, it's backfired. Pessi versus De Gea. And he buries it. You know who it is next. Mini Ron. Boom. He buries it home. It is now level. KSI versus De Gea. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I'm going to go right. Oh, he's missed. Oh, that's perfect green time. You've got this, Rashi. Boom. Let's go. Who's up next? What? Kalon Navas? Why is he up next? Oh, he's in the bar. Sancho to put United through to the finals. Has he got confidence enough to do the Penenka penalty? Yes, he has. And Man United are through to the final. Messi, quick question. How do you feel about Ronaldo making it to the finals and not yourself? They do not deserve it. And he will not speak anymore about this. Goodbye. It's now time for the final. Man United versus Inter Milan. I don't even know how they made it. It's time for Ronaldo to become the world's shortest Champions League winner ever. Let's find out what type of goal we're going to have to score for this next challenge. We've got three boxes left. I'm going to go for number seven as that's Ronaldo's number. What's it going to be? We have to run into the goal in the final of the Champions League. It's time for the final. The tallest team versus the smallest team in the world. Oh my God. Look at the size difference between the teams. <laughs> this could be it. Can we do it first time? No! Oh, no. Oh, what a save. And on the second attempt, Ronaldo managed to get a penalty. And you won't guess who the keeper is. Oh, Vic Star's giving away a pen. To be fair, though. We're going to Penenka it. We're doing it. Please. Yes! Come on! And on the third attempt, Ronaldo came so close. No! But then Inter Milan equalized. Oh, we've conceded in the 90th minute to Inter Milan. And then this happened. Ronaldo run into the goal. Yes! Come on! In the 105th minute, Ronaldo's ran it into the goal. And there you have it. Ronaldo's officially the world's smallest Champions League winner. If you enjoyed this video and you want to see more like this, then consider subscribing and click here to watch this video.